Hi, so here we are going to learn about the positive and negative angles and positive and negative lengths which we use in trigonometry. So what do you mean by positive angles or negative angles or for that matter positive lengths and negative lengths? So to understand that let me first draw few lines. Yes, we call it coordinates. The horizontal line is called x coordinate and the vertical line is called y coordinate and this point of intersection of these two coordinates is called origin. We assume that every distance actually starts from here. So sometimes we write it as 0 comma 0 where 0 represents the length in this direction which is positive x and the second 0 represents the length or the distance in this direction which is positive y. This is plus y and any distance measured from this origin in the opposite direction that means in this direction is referred as minus y and the distance measured in this direction the opposite direction of positive x is referred as minus x. This point is again the origin of the angle also and what is angle? Angle is actually the change in direction. So suppose if I am here and looking in this direction the angle is referred as 0 degrees but if I change the direction this angle is measured from the positive x in the anti-clockwise direction and this will be referred as positive angle or we will call it plus theta. So if the angle is measured anti-clockwise it is referred as positive angle but I can turn towards my right hand side also which will be called clockwise movement and any angle measured clockwise is actually called the negative angle. So if I am standing at the origin and looking at the plus x axis and if I am turning towards my right that means if I am turning clockwise in this direction so the angle also has to be measured in this direction only and this will be called negative angle or minus theta. So the angle measured anti-clockwise is positive theta and angle measured clockwise is minus theta and this is called the negative angle and I think you already knew about the positive and negative lengths measured in coordinates. Keep watching MathSmart for my further videos where we will be clearly understanding how the values of the ratios change when the angle is changed. So keep watching MathSmart and bye bye till then.